So my name is Alicia Lewang Season Bath, and I am a senior level nursing student. So the best part about you being a UCA nursing student is probably my classmates and the faculty. Um, when I applied to nursing school, I applied twice. And I was placed on the wait list twice. And I have to say that that wait was worth it. Um, there hasn't been a time where I have felt like I was alone in this situation, and nursing school really puts you on an emotional roller coaster I wasn't prepared for. Um, and so having those classmates who understand where you're coming from and having that faculty ready and available when you need them has been the best part. There was one semester where I was really struggling academically, and I had a personal challenge of whether I wanted to ask for help or not. And I went ahead and I emailed this professor, and she asked me to come in, and um, instead of telling me all the things that I did wrong, she took the time and pulled up a chair next to me, and we went through every question on the test, whether I got it right or wrong. And she took the time to talk through things and give me the rationale, and didn't make me feel rushed. And that was probably the most special part in that situation, and I ended up flourishing the rest of the semester um, and really have built a bond with that professor. My name is Haley Morton and I'm a level two nursing student at UCA. You know, it's just amazing to see how far I've come. At the beginning, I really felt like I didn't know anything and might even still feel like that sometimes, but you know, you get put in these situations and you just see your nursing instinct kick in and you really see all the things that you've learned from class and how, it's, how it all comes together. I definitely have to uh, time manage everything and make sure I have all my dates down, but you know, with uh, our faculty and being so supportive and understanding with all that, it makes it possible. <laughs> Go Bears! <laughs> I'm Josh Dabney. I'm in my last year of nursing school, so I'm a level four. In my second year of nursing school, so my level three year last year, um, I was having some financial struggles, um, so I wasn't able to buy my textbooks for the semester. Um, I had a faculty member come up to me and said that they would like for me to meet in their office um, because they noticed that I just wasn't really meeting the standards that they had created for me and that I had created for myself. Um, so they, they pulled me aside basically and asked me what was going on and I kind of explained my situation and how I was struggling, and they basically just offered to be here for me. They even let me borrow some of their textbooks and things like that um, to kind of help me through the semester along with some of their resources. It was a um, very beautiful experience to have that with them because it ended up being just like a big old counseling session in a way. It was something that I needed, something that they were able to give, and I appreciate them a lot for that. Don't give up. You'll go through trials, you'll go through tribulations, you'll be here and you'll struggle and you'll doubt yourself. Uh, nursing school's hard. It's supposed to be. I had an idea the other day about how sometimes things are simple, but just because they're simple, they're not easy. This is something that's simple. Going to school is simple. You show up, you listen, you read the books, you do what they tell you to do. It's simple, but it's not easy. So when you come, know that it's not easy, but you can do it. We all have, we all, we're going to graduate and we're going to be amazing nurses one day. I truly believe that, so don't give up. My name is Madison Hightower and I'm a level four nursing student here at UCA. I think the best part about being a nursing student here at UCA is definitely the relationships I've fostered with my peers and my faculty. I always know that I can rely on either a peer or a faculty member to help me through whatever I'm going through. My name is Reina Gutierrez, and I am a UCA nursing student, level two. Well, I think meeting people and getting the actual clinical experience is pretty fun. It's very diverse. I like that. Don't procrastinate. Try not to procrastinate. I mean, it's hard because you're balancing so many other classes in life, and, you know, things happen, and you go through stuff that, you know, doesn't have anything to do with school, but... Try to prioritize. Prioritize. Don't try. Prioritize. It's hard, but it's doable. Like we said earlier, like I said earlier, it's very hard, but you have to put the time in. You have to just keep going. You're going to feel like you can't sometimes. Like you're like, is this really for me? But yes, it is. I mean, you chose it and you're going to have moments where you don't do as good as you want. Um, but don't let that make you, like, use your, your failures and your mistakes as stepping stones to keep going. It's important because 
if you let them get to you and make you feel defeated, then you're going to fail. The goal is success, and mistakes help you learn. My name is Harley Andrews, and I'm a level four nursing student at UCA. I absolutely love the nursing program at UCA. I don't know if any other nursing students can necessarily say that about their program, but it's been extremely difficult, but the most rewarding thing I've ever done. The first semester of nursing school, my grandmother passed away. She was the person who raised me since the time I was 10 years old. Both of my parents passed away when I was younger, so it was the most difficult time in my life on top of being the first semester of nursing. Without the instructor's guidance and their encouragement, I honestly don't know how I would have made it through.